golden case, the best of all. Our motto is run for the children. The sky is our limit. Nothing can stop us. Golden Kiss Academy. We are here once again. We are the only group who are able to count from 100 up to over 10,000 with your fingers. So come along, come and let us learn together. Let's have fun together. Now, we are Africans from Ghana and we are able to bring up how to count from 100 up to over 10,000 on our fingers or with our fingers. Yes. So let's learn. We are here to learn eight times the easiest way. Golden Kiss Academy. The easiest way to learn eight multiplication. First, we're going to start with six multiplication. That is golden methods. We are going to teach golden methods of multiplication, single digits. How to learn single digits multiplication. eight times are you ready we're going to use six or lines multiplication eight times eight times now how to multiply first you rule your lines or six you uh, lay down your six or lines, rule your lines, and then vertically, and then horizontally across. Or if you lie straight, and then across. Or you rule by column, and then rows. Yeah. Any child can rule lines. So over here, you can see we have 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6, 7, 8. And here by row, we have 1, 2, 3, 4. That means 8 times 4. 8 times 4. Then you count all the red dots. Then that will help you to arrive at, arrive at your answer. Example 1, we have 8 times 4. So you rule your lines straight. And then across straight eight and across we have four or column we have eight and rows we have four eight times four then you count all the dots you count one two three four five six seven eight nine ten eleven twelve thirteen fourteen fifteen sixteen seventeen eighteen nineteen twenty twenty one twenty two twenty three twenty four twenty five twenty six twenty seven twenty eight twenty nine thirty thirty one thirty two so the answer eight times four is what thirty two is that clear have you finished Check in. Now here we have 8 times 4. So when you count all the 
dots or the red or where they intersect or where they meet we have 32 8 times 4 equals to 32 Are you done? Okay. Let's shoot on to another method. We have method one, example two. Eight times eight, the same lines or six multiplication. Eight times eight, you rule your lines horizontally 8 vertically 8 or by column 8 or by row 8 and then straight or straight and then across 8 times 8 so you count all the dots so start counting the dots Are you done? We have 8 times 8 equals to 64. 64. 8 times 8 equals to 64. Are you ready for the next method? We have multiplication tips and tricks eight times. Eight times any number, a single number is the number times ten minus double the number 8 times any single number is the number times 10 is that right the number times 10 minus double the number I am clear Okay, example one, let's see. Eight times six is the same as 10 times six minus six plus six. So 10 times six is what? 60 minus six plus six is 12. So 60 minus 12 is the same as 50 minus two, which is 48 48 Are you getting me? Are you done? Okay. Example two. We have eight times seven. So you make it straight away, straight away, ten times seven. 
equals to 70 minus 7 plus 7 equals to 70 minus 14 is the same as 60 minus 4 so the answer is 56 56 Are you with me? Okay. That's great. It's so simple. 70 minus 14. Take the 10 out of 70. So 60 minus 4. Now we have method 3. Double, double, double. That means A times any number. You add the number to itself, the answer, you double the answer as well. And the next answer, you add the, you double the answer also. And you arrive at the final answer. So double, double, double. Three times. That means any number times eight. In a single number times eight. Now let's see example one. Eight times five. So five plus five is ten. Then 10 plus 10 is 20. Again, 20 plus 20 equals to what? 40. So 8 times 5 equals to 40. Are we true? Now we have example 2. 8 times 7. Double, double, double. So 7 plus 7. You double it, that is 14. You double the 14 as well. 14 plus 14. It goes to 28. Then you double the 28. 28 plus 28 equals to 56. 56. Is that clear? Are you done? We have multiplication. That means how to learn the timetable. Eight times. Timetable. The unit column, you have eight. Six four two zero eight six four two zero and the tenth column we have zero one two three four and then four again five six seven eight so now let's watch out.
example one, we have the timetable. So you can see from there, the unit eight, six, four, two, zero, eight, six, four, two, zero. And then the tenth column, please, the five and six, you repeat the four. So we have zero, one, two, three, four, four, five, six, seven, eight. So you study it very easy. Only the tenth column, you repeat the five and six, four, four. So you can see it here. Can we shoot on? We have we have this, we call it row and uh, column table. You have five columns and two rows. So you write eight, six at the unit column. Eight, six, four, two, zero. Then you start again. Eight, six, four, two, zero. Now we, with the tenth column, you write, you start with zero, one, two, three, four. Then you repeat the four again. Four. Five. Six seven eight. So that is how to learn the time table. So you can see it. We have finger multiplication, tips and tricks, eight times. We have the fingers, the little finger is six, the ring finger is seven, and the middle finger is eight, and the pointing finger is nine, and the thumb is ten on both hands. So let's see example. That means you can use from six times to 10 times you can use your fingers to calculate. Now you have 8 times 6. 8 times 6. You put the 6, the little finger, and then the middle finger, 8 together. And then you count down. You count down. You count from the meeting fingers. You have 1, 2, 3, 4. 4 times 10. That means 40. And on my left hand, I have 1, 2, 3, 4. And then on the right hand, I have 2. So 4 times 2 is 8. So 48. 40 down, the red one, and then 8. 4 times 2 is 8. 48. You have example 2. 8 times 7. So 7 is the ring finger and then the middle finger. They meet. Then you count down. You will get 1, 2, 3, 4, 5. That means 5 times 10 is 50. 
on my left hand we have three and then on the right hand we have two so three times two is six so we have 56 56 Now we have example 3. We have 8 times 8. So the middle finger, they are the 8 and the A. So I'll put them together. And then I'll count from the meeting fingers. 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6. That means 6 times 10 is 60. And then 2 times 2 is what? 4. So we have 64. You count the red ones down. So we have 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6. 6 times 10 is 60. And then 2 times 2 is 4. So we have 64. 64. Are you getting the point? Now let's go to example 4. We have 8 times 9. So I'll meet the middle finger and then the pointing finger. I'll put them together. Then I'll count down. 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6, 7. I have 7. So 7 times 10 is 70. And on the left hand, I have two fingers. And then on the right hand, I have only the thumb. So that means two times one. So I have 72. 72. So eight times nine equals to 72. I hope you are getting me right. You are following. Yeah. Now, example five. Or the fifth example. We have eight times ten. Eight times ten. So, the middle finger and then a thumb. You put them together. You have eight times ten is eighty. And then we have two times zero. Because there is nothing there after the meeting fingers so 2 times 0 is 0 so 8 times 10 is 80 is that clear i hope you are enjoying the whole show thanks for watching And steady hard. Mass is so interesting. Yeah. Don't forget to subscribe. Like. And share. Thank you.